What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I'm gonna talk about the Brother Old Chain Stickers printer. I wanna talk about the label in this uh, video. And uh, so this printer, the best part of it was it prints two colors, which is, that was amazing. The first time I saw that, I was really impressed that because this is a thermal printer. So the fact that it can print two colors um, uh, it made it really unique. Um, if you look in the pictures right here, uh, that's really cool. You can print red uh, and uh, black. Uh, the problem that we were facing to, for using it in a, as an old chain sticker, the number one problem it fades so quickly with the temperature, uh, and that was a, a big deal. It was happening in Michigan, so I can only imagine uh how is how is it ha like how fast it's happening in florida or california or texas um uh, the other issue with it too was um, um it's expensive it was 27 dollars and it can only print 300 stickers that's that's expensive especially if you have uh so much volume and uh, the third problem with it there no one else sells it but, but uh, brother so because it's it's uh, it, it's not like uh, I don't know why I'm sure they have the, they have a problem because it's not really successful and let me let me let me show you what I'm talking about I'm talking about I'm not talking about the printer I think the printer is amazing I'm just talking about the label the label if you look right here um, for our old chain sticker if you look at the black the black is not really black it's a black and red and uh, the the red it's not it's not clear it's like um it's not perfected i mean i'm not gonna hate on them for trying but definitely it needs so much improvement and the major major issue despite of all this what may was what was making it or what still makes it uh, fade away so quickly because uh, to print red and black, there's two different temperatures. So basically, when the printer trying to print, um, the red require different temperature, and uh, the black, which is kind of red black, it requires different temperature, and uh, which makes it so easily to fade. I even tested it on the heat, and I saw this one will fade ten times faster than a regular black color only. And when I saw that, I was like, immediately, we need to switch to the other roll that comes with the with the printer. Uh, if you bought the printer, you've noticed there's a big roll and there's a small roll. And then let's look at the small roll. And this is the new all chain sticker. Um, it's look at it. It's already cut uh, from <coughs> from them automatically. So the the, the sticker roll is going to be stickers already cut, and it makes it more professional. Number one. Uh, because it's rounded and number two it's a lot cheaper it's that the roll you can buy it for <clears throat> that's right here so this is the new roll that we're going to be using the dk1201 don't worry you still can use the other one if you want to we're going to have two options but i definitely recommend this one for why why is that because it's only 12 dollars uh, for one roll one roll can make 400 stickers not 300 stickers uh, 400 uh, uh, stickers that they're already uh, what they call it die cut or they're already cut you can buy three uh, for $37 so literally well, that's 400 800 1200 uh, versus uh, 300 because the other one was $27 for $10 more you can buy uh, 1200 so it's a lot cheaper um, uh, and if you search the DK1201 now um, there are so many options from a different, uh, so look at this, so you have so many options from a different the third parties. Now at least you can look because I, I was searching for it and some of them did not have adhesive. So that's going to be on you. I'm not going to uh, uh, research too much on which one is the best uh, for the printer. But I, I do know that um, Brother don't like it when they... When third company and third party comes in and sell their product and they always try to say oh that might damage your printer uh, so keep that in mind uh, it's gonna be 1.1 by 3.5 uh, at first I was like man that's not I don't know if it's too big or too skinny um, once I created it and I put it on the windshield it looked fantastic literally it looks unique um, sometimes you gotta think different and we really thought different 
uh, with this one if you if you look at it it does have the name of your business sticks out so it's kind of cool you can see that for the customer is driving he can see right away where where did he uh, do his old change that way he'll go back to your shop instead of trying to remember where did he do it because the other one if you look at the other one look how small the name was um, the second thing in case an emergency he needs to call you right away the phone number is right there um, uh, and then you get the next service due which is really cool and it, now you can add the date and now you can add the next mileage so the next date and the ne next mileage um, <coughs> versus here we couldn't add the date but we did have mobile one and full synthetic I thought about that and I was like I don't want to crowd it too much uh, let's just leave it just date and uh, um, uh, and and the and next mileage and because you know sometimes if you make a mistake and you and, and you enter like 5w20 instead of 5w30 uh, uh, the customer is going to be pissed even though if you did uh, put in the raw, the correct oil so I was like man this kind of data from uh, like mobile one and full synthetic they should be on the invoice not on the, on the, on the all change stickers so this is look really professional and if you notice if you see man there's a barcode right there that's 2d barcode and that's kind of gonna make the customer curious what's going on with the barcode the barcode actually is for the is the VIN number for that vehicle so anytime every time you print on uh, all chain stickers it's gonna come on with a barcode for the VIN number of the vehicle so if you scan that VIN number uh, let's get let's test it out real quick so open VIP and we're gonna click on a uh, quick estimate I'm gonna scan that small uh, VIN number that's the small barcode the 2d barcode and check this out so I can select the car automatically so yes the going back to the all change sticker yes so the the barcode <coughs> right there is 2d barcode and it's the VIN number for that vehicle I think if I go to your shop and you do an all change and you give me a sticker like that I'm gonna be impressed um, versus uh, I mean, like I said we still support this one it's up to you um, remember to to be able to print this or this uh, this will require the red and black and this will require the black only um, I'm moving away from the red and black just because it's it doesn't look full HD this one it looks full HD it's perfectly um, just because it's black and the best part of it I did test this one for heat and like I said this one can last um, 10 times more than this one so which is I think that should solve the problem I'm not really sure I think we, should, we still need to be testing it but I, I when I was applying heat on both of them at the same time at the same time this one was so fast to fade away just because of the red like I said because they were using two colors so they needed to uh, split the temperature where this one can last uh, way longer plus the, I've noticed the sticker on this one just a little bit thicker which is kind of cool which we need it to be a little bit thicker uh, adhesive wise I really can't help much because I don't make the printer I'm just using the printer for our application and I think the new one is gonna stand out really really good uh, it has our signature at the bottom 2021 VIP shop management which is kind of cool it, you can't really see it but it's there uh, for somebody who's trying to see it uh, people always tell me mark can I add my logo first of all it's a tiny uh, sticker uh, what type of logo is gonna fit perfectly for you every time like we have on, on the VIP right here look how big is the logo here and people are always I see them having a hard time to make it perfectly because it depends on the shape so if we put your logo on black and white right here it's gonna look stupid so I'd rather have a barcode there uh, universal for everybody um, and that way it looks more professional in the end that sticker has to look professional number two the customer doesn't give a rat ass if your logo is there or not keep that in mind because he cannot see it he's not looking for that uh, this sticker is not for us this sticker actually for the customer to know when it's the when the when the all changes do and trust me I with all the technology that we have with the car reminders with the all change and all that this sticker is more valuable and more practical I miss it sometimes and I have all the features because I don't remember when I did the old change I don't remember when the old changes do and plus like I said 
with all that pandemic, what's going on? People not driving much, so they they think they're good. No, you still need to change your oil after three months. So it's all always the, the engine always starving uh, for a new oil. Uh, um, so I think this is uh, it's already deployed. By the way, let's uh, let's go back to the settings. Uh, so like I said, uh, to get the to get the roll, it's right here. It's gonna say the black preferred. If you bought the when you bought the brother, it came already with the. Uh, so I'm not adding something new. Uh, the brother uh, printer did come with the small roll. So go find it. I'm sure you throw it somewhere. I kept it. At least I kept it aside. And uh, if you don't have one, just click on it and buy one for eleven dollars. So it's not that expensive. Uh, the other thing is when you try to print. Oh, let's add the oil mileage. When you try to print, so see where it says red and black. Uh, by default, it's going to be unchecked. If you check it, it's going to take you back to your original way of, of printing. Uh, it's just so basically just a switch. All you have to do is just uncheck it, and you're going to see with the new uh, format, which is just the date and the mileage, which is I think it's really cool. And just click print and just let you know it's even faster printing like I said because it's one color uh, it's more effective it looks beautiful by the way I, I I was tearing at it on the windshield so this is really cool anyway I appreciate you guys until next time uh, thanks for watching